In 2009, a massive dead star exploded in a powerful burst, and astronomers were able to observe the star before and after the blast from Earth. The explosion is what's known as a classical nova, an event that involves a dead star known as a white dwarf and its companion star. Classical nova explosions attract attention when they erupt in a bright flash of light. But because these explosions are unpredictable, very little has been known about the process leading up to the burst. Now, a team of Polish scientists say they've gained new insights into the evolution of classical nova explosions by monitoring a star system over the course of 12 years. In 2003, they began observing the stars located 23,000 light years away from Earth through a telescope at the Las Campanas Observatory in Chile. In the six years leading up to the classical nova explosion, the scientists saw the star system periodically brighten. They say that periodic brightening is evidence that the second star transferred small portions of hydrogen gas onto the surface of the white dwarf, a process known to lead up to a classical nova explosion. When the matter dumped onto the star's surface reached a certain point, in 2009 it triggered a thermonuclear reaction that led to the eruption, the scientists say. Although the star system survived the blast, the scientists predict that in the next decades, the transfer of matter will gradually decrease and the white dwarf will fade. The star may then fall into hibernation again for thousands of years, until it awakes and eventually explodes again as a classical nova. But that could take another million years, scientists say.